What's up, Sonny? What's up, Vlad? It's just a small stream. That's all. Nothing too serious. Just seeing how things run. We'll see what we can increase in our way. Well, yeah, I can do the test server, but I also don't want to just go into the game without recording it. So if I can do a small test stream, have you guys join me for maybe an hour? Uh, that's good enough for me. Can't stay too long because I work tonight. <laughs> Look at that cute little loading bar. All right, first off, I want to say, hell yes. <laughs> I actually like this a lot better than what was going on beforehand, where you wake up on the base and you're part of a study that's been there for a while. No, I mean, it's fine, but this one was much more epic. You're someone who is sneaking their way onto the planet. Ah, oh, it's just, that's cool. That's a good opening. I hadn't seen that yet. 
Enjoy your stay. New blueprint synthesized. Arctic survival on it. This meteor storm kind of sucks. But yeah, guys, welcome to the full release. So far, I'm not having too much issue. Oh, I'm getting cold. Heat plant, wait, warm me up. Holy smokes. That did not go as planned. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. Below is there just from Nautica, but on land? No, not really. So Nautica below zero is some Nautica, but in the ocean of the Arctic. You know, the Arctic Ocean. The, uh, the cold side of the planet. Oh, I just walked back. <laughs> Heat plants. Ow, I'm a burn. Ooh, some slight lag. Ah, yes. Welcome back, Subnautica. Ah, oh, it's been too long. Burning making you warm? You know what? That is true. Look at the peeper. I like the... This is early for you, bud. Yeah, just a bit. Found it's... Drop pod. Uh, this is only stream title about FCT, by the way. What? Stream, small stream of cold oceans. What? <laughs> stream title by FCT? You mean fact? Stream title about fact? Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Sam. I want to offer my sincerest condolences on the passing of your sister. Oh, I got to know Sam uh, better sorry. towards the end of my mandate with Altera on 4546B, when we were thrown together as pacemates at Outpost Zero. She spoke often and fondly of you. Jeez, I thought why you is everyone know, here? <laughs> it didn't sit right with me when Altera blamed Sam's death on negligence. The Samantha Ayu I met was many things. Kind, clever, devoted to her work, but never negligent. I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my access to information has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave, and there might still be information to be found there. It has a big radio tower, impossible to miss. I hope you find the answers you seek. Lillian Bench. Hmm. Notice of death. Mi Dear Miss A, on behalf of Zeta Lund Landon, 4546B Robotics Section Leader, Indra Cormac, President of Altera Transgov, I regret to inform you the death of Samantha A. U. She died on planet 4546B, regrettably as a result of injuries sustained in an accident arising from her own intelligence. Her own negligence. Please allow me to communicate the most profound condolences for the loss of your sister. All further details are unavailable at this time. You will receive contact from the Department of Insurance and recuperation concerning your responsibilities as next of kin. 
with regards to repayment of damages and legal fees. Wow. That sucks. You got any questions? Give me five hundred. We'll be addressed in sequential order. Blah blah blah. Robin, guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian amphibian under real-world stress conditions. Listen, I know your stance on Altera, but I just hope you're happy your sis is happy. I sure hope my sis is happy. <laughs> I can't wait till we talk again. Oh, I wanted to ask you something. Can you watch my Augie while I'm away? I need someone I can trust to look after my best little potato. <laughs> potato, listen. I tried, but that name is just not sticking. He's my little extra bite. I'll leave the starchy tuber as nicknames to you. Mm. Anyway, if you say yes, thanks, baby sis. Love you. Four five four six B to Robin. Come in, Robin. <laughs> Remember when we used to play old timey space explorer? This is kind of like that, but it's even harder to communicate. <laughs> well, let's see. I got your last message. Altera is not, as you put it, all terrorizing me. Things are going well. My project has a new name. Say goodbye to the mechanical avian amphibian and hello to spy panglings. We're training the bots to mimic the creatures. Check out the photo. And I think I'm kind of seeing someone. <laughs> I know it's not like me to just find a date, let alone on a mostly uninhabited water planet, but Actually, you know what? Forget I said anything. <laughs> yeah, it's it's probably not even a real thing, but anyway, um I'm sorry to hear Xenoworks might be strapped in the revenue department. Sounds like they still have you. Alright, bye KJ. Working, Thank you for dropping by. I know there's no way to guarantee an alien intelligence startup will succeed, but you've put so much into it. I hope they find a way to keep going. I know how much it means to you. Getting to work at a small place where you have control over your research. All right, I gotta go. Later, baby sis. Love you. Hmm. All right, we'll come back to that. Let it go. Be sync is off, and I don't want it off. Let's More check this. Supply cash nearby. Oh, yeah. Sorry, your sister died, but you now own her debts. That sounded like they not just her debts, but any kind of damage that may have been caused by her. Hey, we know your sister may have caused issues, but you get to own your sister's problems now. It sucks. And what's bad is that people, will, those companies will actually do that. It's sad. Oh, it's a pigling. Cuties. I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I don't think so. Oh, no, it's Fred! This planet is cursed. <laughs> There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, you're probably right. That's nothing. You wouldn't want to hear about it anyway. Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave, not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird part. As soon as I called it in, they closed off the area. Don't want anyone going in there. But why? Sammy, I'm no biologist, but I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off. Alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, Sam. Something ain't right. Wish I could show you, but I can't get back in there. You can't. But I might know how to. Whatever you're thinking, 
We never had this conversation. All right, so if you guys don't know who Fred is, Fred is actually from the trailer. Uh, that's super interesting that they ended up bringing him into it. I'll have to come back. Oxygen. Yeah, yeah. Should be able to use this. It's nice that our character actually has a voice. Oh, it's snowing. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> oh, wow. Cake, what are you doing? He's getting five tier one subs to the community. Cake, I swear. Look, I'm not the one who gets the subs. I give you the subs. Oh, anyway, thank you so much, Cake. Look at that gold bar crow. Yep. I only need, what, uh, two more? And we get our next emote slot? Well, thank you so much, Cake. It's really appreciated. Oh, my gosh. You did not have to do that. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Jeez. Oh, anyone who got uh, a sub? What? No! Craig, stop! <laughs> Cake, I swear! You're not loud! Ah, jeez. Emote slot. Yeah, we got a new emote slot, guys. Well, thank you so much, Kay. You did not have to do that. It's, it's super appreciated. I'm sorry I don't get all squealy like you can. I know uh, I'd probably be a lot more popular. Oh, what you wanted to? Oh, well, thank you so much, Kay. I need to do something for you. What is something I can actually pass Cyclone? He's going to love it. Uh, she's all, she was already past Cyclone. She was at 5. Now she's at 12. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much, Cake. That is really appreciated. Oh my gosh. So, our new subscribers. X Gaming subscribed. Kaboom Stream subscribed. Kobe, not really a name. Nero. We got Creeper Kitty. Just a Banana Croissant. He never gonna catch up. <laughs> Definitely. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I had to catch some sleep, so I'll catch you next time. Alright, thank you so much, Kate. Please just let me know if you need me to do anything for you. I'm down to play some games or hang out or whatever. <laughs> Hell, I could do a tarot reading for you again. If you want. Yeah, KJ missed it. Aww. What happened to your stream, Cake? Are you all done? Are you still here? Yes, thank you very much. Let's take a look at it real quick. Let me take a look. Mm, 
emotes. Yep, we got a new tier one slot. Guess what, guys? We can now either move. Oh, God. So we have one, two emotes that we can move to that new tier one slot. And I will let you know, though. I'm, okay. We have two emotes that we can move right now. And we'll have to, I'll have to draw more uh, stuff in order to get more, to fill those slots. So we can either eat move eat dad uh into that new tier one slot or we can move Pog Fox. That god awful picture that I drew. So it can be uh this or this. Pog Fox? No. Oh. <laughs> it's so good. Though. It's so dumb. All right, fine. I'll have to remove it and then re upload it. So give me just a moment. And that'll take that will take time to um re add. There we go. So that'll take some time to get approved, but that is now a tier one emote. Tier one. Yeah. Uh, the next goal is 10 more. All right. Bye, Cake. Thank you so much. I, I can't. Oh, I, you don't know how much I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Bye. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. Uh, let's see. Well, I'm out. So now it's 35 and we're at 25. There we go. That is just a reminder of how many more we have to the next slot. Uh, going from 25 to 35. But yes, uh, I do hope... Uh, Everyone appreciates what Cake did. It was very, very nice. Oh my gosh. I really appreciate that. <sighs> okay. Uh, apart from that, uh, shall we uh, continue? <laughs> gosh, I don't know what to do for that. that I'm so... Co it's like confusion with excitement mixed into a ball of anxiety because I don't know how to return the... The favor because well to be honest i've given her what 56 subscriptions all right so i've supported her for a long time and she just comes in and just donates seven i'm like well no you can't do that you're not allowed i do that <laughs> i don't know new creature discovered New creature discovered. Well, I guess 
I mean, she's not here. I, well, her character is still here. But I'm going to shout her out. No. I'm going to shout her out. So, uh, go follow her channel. Go support her as much as she does me. And, uh, because I definitely support her a whole lot. Still the mushroom, isn't it? Acidic mushrooms. If I can find any. Cuties. Where am I supposed to find these acidic mushrooms? Are these it? Let's see, to... Oxygen. Maybe the recipe's changed. I'll have to see. New creature discovered. See if I can increase my settings. Although I like it running butter smooth, I do like a little bit of graphics. It turned off my VSync, didn't it? There we go. Yeah, that's not too bad. Ribbon plant. Oh. Is that this thing? It looks like this thing. Ribbon plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage.
scanner. All right, I have a scanner. I scan everything. I need to make a knife. Penguin. Ooh. They're so cute. Bits cold stuff. New blueprint synthesized. If I can just grab one more, it would be nice. Oh wait, no, I didn't want to drop that, I wanted to eat it. You can see why this one makes it a little bit more daring to go diving. Because you might not have an opportunity to resurface. Basically an issue. Paper. Oh. Mm. 
lubricant. I didn't want to make that, but okay. blueprints to your data bank oh cool the standard oxygen tank can be upgraded for deluxe and VIP breathing VIP breathing, you say? Only the best VIP breathing. The only VIP breathing. You want to be? You want to breathe? You got to pay for it. I need a battery, lubricant, copper wire, titanium. Seek fluid intake. Vital signs stabilizing. I need another battery. God, I wonder how quick Markiplier, Jacksepticeye, and who else was known to play this? Captain Sauce? I'm sure, Captain Sauce will get into it. He loves playing this. I need shell. I need titanium. That's just fine. It should give me titanium. <laughs> they already beaten the game and uploaded the 20 episodes. It's just going now. Impossible. This release like sometime in the night. YouTubers man. The sea glide is a personal transportation device used for high speed free diving. Contains a built in light and map. Yes. Wonderful. Who I on? They got time powers, so <laughs> that and early act, uh, early access to games because people want them to try the new stuff. I don't know. Oh, well, it definitely seems like that case. What we got? A mineral detector fragment. New blueprint synthesized. Warning. 
30 seconds of oxygen remaining. So I do a mineral detector. All you need is a battery and more copper. I do like the pin system. The pin system is nice. Ooh, what's this? Ross Alleys! What the heck is that? A symbite. Ah, it's cold. A small, fast predator which has to set the hole of the titan whole fish and defends them at all costs. Ooh. This game can be so pretty. I love Subnautica for its design details. Uh, this one is just, it's got it. It's just like more Subnautica. Who wouldn't, doesn't want more Subnautica, you know? I need one more copper. Yeah. Alright, so that should make me a battery and a line. What is this? A coral bridge. Coral bridge is formed by rapidly growing coral polyps that exhibit Thygmotropism, which causes growth and response to stimuli or when touching a solid object. Coral bridges grow in thick, twisty patterns that anchor onto rocks or other coral. The underside is covered in colonies of blue barnacle. Ooh. They look like tentacles. I think that was like early, early theories is that these were tentacles leading up to a massive beast. Thick twisted patterns. They look really cool. One battery. Oh, I need one more copper. Great. Who knows, maybe the entire planet is one giant super organism. Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me. Shit like that is said to be like major stories, whatever. It's like a science fiction staple. Space exploration giant beings that could be sizes of planets where beings could live off of them. Always a very eye-catching uh, story to it. Alright, so we now have a mineral detector. The mineral detector can sniff out raw materials, potentially saving you hundreds of hours of searching. Really? Quartz. Copper? Oh my gosh. Why did they have this in the first game? God, this the first game wouldn't be so bad if you could just look at this thing. Uh, 
they have an in-game system of saying where mineral is. Oh my gosh. That's so smart. High praise. High praise to the developers. I don't think this was a part of it until the release. What else can I say? Fragments, crystalline sulfur, salt deposits. Seek fluid and take. <sighs> I'm Ed Fluid. Vital signs stabilizing. You know what? That is true. All right, where should we go now? Let's head this way. Yeah, a mineral to Oh jeez. A mineral detector is so smart. What the hell is that? I am stone. Fragment. Ah oh, sweet. There's fragments I can scan. Oxygen plant. Honestly, I wouldn't want to sip any of that oxygen. Who knows how long it's been down here? Ooh, a sea monkey nest. This is definitely interesting. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Thank you for the uh, oxygen. Whoa, okay. Shopping this way.
I wonder what's over here. Definitely seems like something. Wait, did I just end back at my crash site? Yeah, I just ended back at my crash site. Son of a bitch. Here I was thinking I was exploring. In the end, I wasn't doing shit. It only works underwater. Noises. The heck? That sounds like a distress call. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. Where at? Ouch. I guess I'm not allowed to really know. Intelligent herbivore which shows great interest in other life forms in their possessions. More research needed to understand about life form and behavior. Oh wow, that's deep. What the hell is that? What is that? What's going on? Something spooky is happening. Ooh, a sea truck. Well, the vehicle bay is always appreciated. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining.
as you saw. They don't look friendly. Seek fluid and take. Vital signs stabilizing. Oh gosh, it's so deep. It's so deep. Ah, a familiar feeling of the unknown. Where you don't actually want to know what's un in the unknown. Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Hi, Jelly. Cool. Hi, Jelly. Your sights and deep wires. It is made of three distinct body sections. Warning. 30 tentacles seconds of oxygen the remaining. The inner tentacles are covered in bioluminescent nodes to attract prey. Cool. Oh, I'm very uh, far from the surface. Give me oxygen. Supposed to find a tower or something. Not really sure where to look for that though. It's always snowing, cloudy, or foggy. I wonder what kind of leviathans are part of this game. Ooh. I feel like I've wandered too far away. Warning. Entering ecological dead zone. The prospect for survival is fast approaching zero. Nope. Oh, I'm turning back. Ah! Jesus! That's why. <laughs> it scared the crap out of me. <laughs> just came out of nowhere and just tried to take a bite out of my shins. Oh my gosh. And it just disappeared back into the darkness. Oh, jeez. Alright, let's uh... Let's head back. Did no one else see that?
<laughs> Dead zone, zero chance of reverse survival. What's that? Ah! I mean, he definitely spooked me. Alright, well, that's the dead zone. AKA, don't go near here if you want to survive. Thermal spire, nice. Ooh, you're a big boy. I'm uh, going to avoid you. Yeah, <laughs> twisted patterns. I don't read it that way. Although it is interesting that he brought the ecological dead zone back. Meaning that the only source of life are things that are closer to the surface. Anything in that deep depth after, what, so many years after the virus was cured still hasn't grown back because it's so deep. That's definitely an interesting add-on. Picked up what sounds like a distress call. Who or what is out here calling for help? Didn't sound human. Maybe it's from a remnant of architect technology. In her message, Sam's colleague did say there was something important here. Even if it's just a mimic from one of the more intelligent aquatic specimens, that could be a major find. Or if it's from Altera, it could have bearing on what happened to Sam. I should definitely check it out. I don't even remember where that was. Are you not gonna... I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area. Oh, here we go. But luckily, this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos 5. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. In goes a battery in titanium, now comes a scanner. Every xenobiologist's favorite tool. This planet has some fascinating flora and fauna, and I can't wait to learn about them. This will also give me access to a greater tool set. I'm assuming Altera left behind tech that I can scan for blueprints. That should make surviving and exploring out here a bit easier. Don't worry, Sam. I haven't forgotten I'm here for you. But it can't hurt to do a little research on the side, right? I know you would have done the same. I will find out what happened to you. I promise. Hmm. Well, uh, in any case, guys, I am going to end it here. Uh, I was only going to do a small test stream. I got to do laundry, take a shower, and go to bed for work tonight. Uh, but I enjoyed this so much, I will probably play this for the next week. And only this, because holy crap, it's back. And it's just the same feeling of Subnautica. Ah, oh, just, I love it so much.
But anyway, thank you guys for joining me. Thank you, Cake, so much for the subscriptions. Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely running better than uh, Resident Evil 8, which I won't be able to run until they post a patch about it. Like a hot fix. But I haven't seen anything about that yet. Hell, they might not even do that. But yeah. Um, hell, unless you guys want me to play the first one first. I've already beaten it. I don't even know if I want to go through that again. Uh, but that might be for a later time. I'm definitely playing this. And um, who knows? Let's see what happens. Uh, thank you guys so much again for joining me. You've already been spoiled. Exactly. <laughs> Uh, well, even with Resident Evil 8, I don't, I don't mind going through that again. You have a mineral scanner. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, that, that, yes, I'm spoiled with that. I don't know if I want to go through hours of searching when I could just find the minerals. Whew, definitely a load off my mind. Uh, well, thank you guys uh, a lot for joining me today. Um, thank you, uh, cake for your gift subs a full seven subs that's amazing thank you so much it was unnecessary did not have to do that uh, but I, I will have to put in suggestions uh, if you guys have ideas of what to make uh, emotes out of please let me know and I will do what I can to work on that uh, I appreciate uh, everyone that joins my streams and uh, thank you all for joining me. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day.